I still do not know whose ghost you hope to become. In your letters to your sister, you write about all the things you did for love and out of love. I read them and reread them until the meaning of words dissolved and your handwriting became a cipher for recovering all the things we had forgotten. In my roundabout pursuit of you, I found myself haunted by your words, by the things that we never recorded or documented, but whose absence we clearly felt. I asked you once if you thought that soil contained memories. You answered, if it could remember, then we would eat all the lifetimes it had consumed. In your time at Kew Gardens, you often talked about freedom. Your inquisitive mind, your rebellious streak always got you into trouble. I remember because I often felt you left me out on purpose. Like the things we had shared moved to a quiet murmur in the background. And only the object of your current obsession could ever draw your attention at any given time. What things should be unearthed? What should be allowed to rest beneath the ground? What do we preserve? If the soil remembers, why do we need to dig, taxonomize, and catalog 